Good morning everybody, hello and welcome to this video. I'm Inkslaura123 and this is going to be a spend the day with me vlog. It's uh, Saturday, I don't even know the time actually, <laughs> I just kind of got up and uh, got ready quick and have gone out. So, But it's morning, it's Saturday morning at some point. Um, sorry I look a complete mess but oh my god it's so cold. It is so cold, but it's really weird because it's really bright sunshine as well. It's making me squint, but yet freezing cold. Um, yeah, my hair was a complete mess this morning, so I've just put on my hat. And uh, it's my West Ham hat. Up the Ammers, come on your irons. <laughs> um, yeah, it's like really icy and cold and they predict, predict we'll have snow tomorrow and Monday so we'll see I mean me and Nathan keep saying it's cold enough for snow and I truly believe it is it's freezing I've got a thick jumper on and this jacket which is quite thick as well and I'm still bloody freezing look at all the leaves hold on you can see where the leaves are like frosted over Whew, look at that it's yeah it's really cold there's no one about by the way this is quite creepy and then there's someone behind me, that's all right. Yeah, so I'm off out to get a few bits and pieces, like drinks and stuff, in case there is snow. Um, and yeah, I've got a parcel my mum wants me to take back for. Her. It's one of those catalogue ones, so it has to go to a little shop with a code and stuff, I don't know. So I said I'd take it back for her. God, I'm trying not to slip on these leaves oh my god there's so many of them they are quite pretty actually the frosted leaves <sighs> but yeah so welcome to this video i'm not going to be doing uh, an awful lot today i just kind of want a lazy one really i do need to try and do some filming so i need to try and motivate myself for that um and i need to do some reading which normally I love reading because <laughs> I'm a bookworm but at the moment I am struggling because the book I'm reading I'm not particularly enjoying but I've got to read um, I was doing a buddy read with the lovely hold on it's really icy over here um, with the lovely mini book chats Kate she's lovely check out her channel if you're into booktube um, yeah we're reading a book together called Midwinter Murders by Agatha Christie and uh Oh my days, it's so icy, it's like an ice rink. Um, sorry, I'm so paranoid about bloody slipping. Oh, there's a lady behind me, I'll move out of the way. Sorry. <laughs> I'm so scared of slipping. No, no, it's, not. <laughs> it's not even that bad, Jake. it get worse on the weekend. I know. <laughs> um, I was like, yes, yeah, so we're doing this buddy read together and then we are doing a live show together on her channel where we... Um, like discuss the book and stuff and I'm just yeah I'm really not enjoying it the first story was okay it's like a collection of mysteries like cozy mysteries with like a winter Christmas theme um and it's hit or miss for me with Agatha Christie stuff like I don't know like I don't like Miss Marple stories I just I don't know about the character I don't like I just I don't know what it is um so yeah I was struggling with that one the first story I read as I say that was quite good but I don't know. I like Poirot, and I think the next one in the collection is Poirot Story. So that should be... Oh, my days. It's so icy on the floor. Uh, that should be a bit better. But, yeah, I'm just... I'm struggling with it. And I <laughs> just kind of, in a way, want to just get it done. And they're only short little stories. I think they're, like, sort of 19, 20-ish pages each. So I'm just going to kind of work my way through this book, get it done, uh, write my notes about it, and move on to the book that's next <laughs> so yeah i've got to do that today um oh it's so cold see uh i don't know if you can see it it's smoke or well, not real smoke but it looks like smoke coming out when i was a kid i don't know why i did this but i used to pretend i was smoking in the winter and go like anyway that's weird <laughs> oh this upsets me this is where my grandma used to live oh hence i don't oh my look at all this oh god hence i don't really walk around this way much i'm gonna put my foot on it oh yeah it's a little bit slippery oh god 
yeah I don't really walk around this way much because it just triggers me and just oh my days can you see all that white oh oh gee okay I'm gonna have to cross this side oh 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 but yeah that is where she used to live so not that one the one the second one in that was um her lounge window there like a front room and kitchen and that one was the bedroom oh it just makes me upset i don't want to look i do want to look because it's like a memory but i don't want to look because it makes me sad but um yeah. <sighs> this weather i love the snow i love playing in the snow and do you want a bit of snowman but what i hate is the ice i don't like ice um which is actually really interesting because recently i've discovered um, or oh, i was told that i have autism i'm on spectrum oh jeez and apparently, it's a very common thing among, pe among, not all people, but some people with autism. <laughs> I'm literally walking like a weirdo. Um, that, yeah, the weather change can really trigger you off with your anxiety. And I've always discovered that. I, oh my days, I've got to get down like a thing here. Um, this was a bad idea. Why did I say... I didn't know it would be like this. They said it wouldn't be like snowy icy until tomorrow. Hence, I went out today. <laughs> so I didn't have to go out tomorrow. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, apparently that is a common trigger that you get, like, anxious. And I do. Like, with certain weather changes. Like, ice makes me really anxious and cold. And I don't like feeling really hot in the summer. I get very anxious if I'm really, really hot. So it's another thing that I've learned about myself. You know, of my traits since discovering I'm on the spectrum, you know, you kind of get this list and you're like, yep, yeah, got that, got that, got that, got that, yeah, do that, you know, so, anyhow, I'm going to stop rambling, um, I'm wearing one glove at the moment, <laughs> because I need the other hand free so I can touch my phone when I'm filming, so I'm going to pop my other glove on and put this phone in my pocket, so I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so I'm at home now, the time is half past 11, I've got some warm cornflakes some people are really grossed out when i say like hot cereal but it's nice try it don't knock it try it um it's my grandma's thing she used to always do um a bowl of like warm milk with her cereal and yeah obviously did it for me as well and i've grown up with it so for me it's like oh it's nice anyhow uh <laughs> sorry for my messy hair look at this look it's just i mean what is this what 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 is this <laughs> that's a style oh my oh god um but yeah so i'm just gonna chill i'm gonna watch celebs go day in which i love such a funny show um mum's gone out shopping so with her friend kelly so yeah i don't know if she's gone morrison's or asda or somewhere i don't know but she's she's gone supermarket shopping so nathan's still asleep um and I'm just, yeah, just chilling down here. I've got downstairs to myself, which means I have the TV to myself. <laughs> so I'm going to watch Celebs Go Dating. If I get time, Made in Chelsea, but I don't think I will have. Because I know this show's like an hour. Um, and I don't think my mum would be that long. So we'll see. But um, I could always watch Made in Chelsea upstairs on the TV. We'll see. Anyway, but yes, yeah, so I'm just going to chill for a bit. Um... I love Celebs Go Dating. It's so funny. And a little bit of random news about that. I tweeted Sunita the other day. So Sunita is a famous kind of like 80s pop star. Uh, I don't know if she was in America as well. I think she was in Europe and stuff. But we, we know her here in the UK. Uh, she also used to be Simon Cowell's girlfriend, which was like a big thing. Um, and yeah, I, I've not really kind of seen her on TV. Like I know her music and I've seen her on like The X Factor back in the day. But I don't really know her. But on this show, she comes across so sweet and adorable. And I don't know, some of the stuff she was saying was really, like, emotional. Like, it really got me. And I, I just randomly tweeted Sunita. And it was something like, you're adorable, you're such a sweet soul, and, you know, love you on the show. And she liked the tweet. But then she also actually replied to my tweet. And she was like, oh, you are too. Thank you so much. I was like, oh. Anyway, that's my little claim to fame. But she, she's just super lovely. And I hope she finds love or... You know, at least, you know, find someone she connects with in some way. Um, but yeah, it's a really good show. It's good. Anyway, so I'm going to watch that. Eat me cereal. Um, my hair is a complete mess. Look at this. It's ridiculous. <laughs> um, what am I doing? Oh, my. Um, 
I do need to get in the shower soon, which I would do. I mean, obviously I had a little wash and stuff before I went out, but I want to have a nice shower, nice warm shower to warm me up because it's quite cold. Um, and yeah, do my hair and um, yeah. But yeah, I'm going to chill with the TV first, then get in the shower and all that stuff. So I thought I would uh, quickly show you my current read. So this is the book that I'm buddy reading with a lovely mini book chats. And we're going to be doing our live show together soon, talking about the book, etc. Uh, feel free to read along with us um, and then you can join in the stream and talk about the book and stuff. But it's Agatha Christie's Midwinter Murder. Uh, this is the hardback edition. Um, how beautiful is this? It's so pretty. By the way, I just done my nails really quickly. They don't look perfect, but they look better than they did. Um, but yeah, basically it is a collection of like winter Christmas themed stories. So they are all, um, what have we got here? The Chocolate Box, Christmas Tragedy, The Coming of Mr. Quinn, The Mystery of the Baghdad Chest, Clergyman's Daughter, Plymouth Express, Problem at Palenza Bay, Sanctuary, The Mystery of Hunter's Lodge, The World's End, The Manhood of Edward Robinson sounds very... I don't know what that's going to be about. Um, Christmas adventure. But yeah, I don't know. Like, I'm just uh, I'm not enjoying it, really. I mean, the Poirot story was okay. But I'm just not liking Miss Marple. And anyway, I'm not going to moan about it. I'm just going to get through the book and get it done. But yeah, this is my current read. But um, let's say, I'm only like, if, you know, not even halfway. Hold on, where's my bookmark? I've lost your bookmark. Where you are? Where are you? Ah, I found my bookmark. That is not good. <laughs> so it's obviously um because i was reading last night before i went to bed it's obviously fell out on the sofa uh where did i get up to i read the chocolate box i think i'm up to the coming of mr quinn i think if i can remember rightly hmm. but anyway so yeah I'm, i've still got all these to read so i might like these so i'm keeping an open mind trying to keep positive but yeah that is that Okay everybody, so the time is now nearly quarter past three. Bit of a change of plan. I am out again. Um, oh, oh, it's a bit bumpy, sorry. Uh, Mum's given me a lift kindly uh, to Sainsbury's because, yeah, I need bread. She went shopping this morning and she was going to get me some bread but they didn't have the bread that I want. I'm really fussy. I only like the Warburton's bread and they didn't have any. Um, it's like brown wholemeal Warburton's. So, because we might be having snow, I say might, we don't know. Um, but yeah, if there is snow, I am not going out in the snow because ice terrifies me. Uh, I'll play in the garden in the snow, lovely, but I'm not walking in the streets with ice. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I thought, you know what, I'm just going to come Sainsbury's, grab some bits and pieces. Uh, I'm also going to get some cheese as well before, um, because there's hardly any left in there last week, so I don't want to be like waiting for the Christmas rush and everyone eats all my cheese so I'm going to grab that um, Nathan wants me to get him a tub of roses for Christmas because I just happened to tell him they've got all like uh, tubs of roses in there so he's giving me the money to get him some roses um, I can't eat them which is quite sad because they will pull my fillings out but I can look at them and sniff them <laughs> but um, yeah so just a few bits and pieces um, I need some vegan sausage rolls as well so I'm just going to kind of do -do 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 dart round quickly. I've got my list on my phone. So, um, oh, it's so bumpy, speed bumps. Um, yeah, so I've got my list on my phone. I'm just going to kind of grab everything and then get back. Right, I'm just getting a trolley. I need to find one of the little pound coins uh, for the trolley. There we go, put that in there. I've got to be quick. I feel like I'm on supermarket sweep. Do not look at clothes. <laughs> I'm not here for clothes shopping. Right, avoid the clothes. Oh my days, look how cute that is. Little elves there. All in <laughs> holding hands. That is actually super cute. Wow, that was £10 reduced to 3 Oh my days, that is actually a really good bargain. That is a really good one. It's supposed to be in a rush. And I'm here looking at the reduced decorations. <laughs> no, get away, Laura. 
Okay, right. Cool, it's really busy in here. I do not like busy places. But it is what it is. Let's go get on with it. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, right. So, uh, I wanted to look to see. I hate this aisle because it's meat and I'm a vegetarian. But they might have um, something for Nathan that he was after. Some steak. Oh, this is so horrible. Sirloin. Um, what is this? Oh, God, it looks disgusting. Remember, I'm a vegetarian, so this to me is like gross city. All right, okay, there we go. All right, tin of roses. Let's do this. I'm not sure they have fiver. Yep, that's good. So he's got the roses. All right, I'm looking for the cheese. Where is the cheese? What aisle? Oh, thank you. <laughs> He must have heard me. Where's the cheese? Right. Oh. Fruity juices. Oh, I need Yakult. Where are they? Oh, here's the cheese. Ah, no. I forgot the Yakult. Where are they? They should be over here somewhere. Yakult light. Come to me. Right, there we go. They're the light ones. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, turn that round. What? Where am I being dragged to? No. Why is this happening? Why am I being pulled to the books? Nah, nothing exciting. Right, get away from the books, Laura. Get away from the books. I've got to hurry up. My mum's just sitting in the car. <laughs> She's like, don't be long. I was like, I won't be. I like your t-shirt. Thank you. <laughs> and baby Yoda on his t-shirt. Right, where are we going here? Where are we going? God, it's really busy in here. Ugh, I, hate, I hate busy places, seriously. Ugh. Mind you, I've chose the worst freaking time to come on a bloody Sunday. Uh, Sunday? Saturday afternoon. Right, okay. <sighs> okay, have we got my bread? Is it here? No. Right, well, we've got the big wall buttons. Oh no, hold on. Yes! Yes, I oh, know that's the big one as well. I want the little war buttons. I'll get one of them just in case. But I'm after the little one. Where are you? Oh, oh I found it. I found it. Right, got one here. Oh, go get my thing out of the way. Sorry. Uh, is there any more? Yeah. Oh, God, I'm leaning over. Break my bloody back. Might get one of them as well. Right, okay, let's do this. Get out of here. It's so busy. I don't like it. Too many peoples. <laughs> oh, pick up this. Sorry about that. I need to get to that freezer. Right, all the corn stuff. That is what I am after. But I want the vegan... Oh, here they are. Vegan sausage rolls. Yeah. That one looks a bit bashed in, that box. I won't have that one. Okay. Okay, so the time is 20 past 7 and I'm very pleased with myself because I've actually done some filming. Yes, I've motivated myself to do some filming. I've done a couple of ASMR videos. I plan on doing a third now as well. So that'd be good. If I can get three done today, I'll be quite happy with myself. I don't upload every day. I kind of upload every other day. So that's like a good few days in advance. And hopefully even tomorrow I can film another couple. Then it kind of takes the pressure off me a little bit so yeah i filmed as i say asmr videos including a video with this tinsel uh let my tinsel give you tingles <laughs> um please subscribe to my asmr channel the link is down below as are the links to my social media as well so come and follow me on um what have i got twitter instagram tiktok and goodreads if you are a bookworm talking about books i am kind of liking the book that i'm reading a little bit more um the last two stories that i read um they were okay. They weren't amazing, but they were okay. So that is good. I just, in a way, I just, I just really want to get this book done now and just move on. That saying that, I don't know what to move on next to. So I'm going to sit on the floor in a bit and just kind of look through my book piles and think, hmm, what do I fancy? Because yeah, I've got loads of books. I know this. I know this. But it's what I fancy. Um, what am I in the mood for? It should be a Christmas book, really, because I've got loads of Christmas books. But I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm just going to have a little look um just kind of go with the flow whatever kind of takes my my fancy i'm a mood reader so 
Um, obviously, this one has been like um, a mystery. I can't remember what I read last. Oh, I read um, the Christmas short stories book, didn't I? So I've had two books in a row where they've been like short stories kind of collections. Not really my thing. So I've done quite well. Um, but yeah, this one is, um, I say, Agatha Christie. And that, so that's like a mystery. So I don't, I don't really fancy another mystery thriller -y kind of thing. So maybe like a fantasy or romance or i don't know i'm just gonna have a little look see what i've got anyhow i am gonna try and film this video now so wish me luck and i'll see you in a bit Whew, okay i just went to uh film this part of the vlog and i started choking i was like <laughs> anyhow so i'm very proud of myself managed to get another video done so it's three in total today which is good very stressful though during the filming process i had a noisy car go past i had the dog next door bark because they obviously had a delivery and he goes mad um mum's tv was on loud she was on the phone it was just a yeah nightmare my dad rang it, yeah but i got them done and they're uploaded now i filmed on my phone so i didn't need to edit or anything which was great it was like yes don't need to edit when i make mistakes then i need to edit but i didn't so i was like boom just upload it videos are done um i'm gonna put one on tonight i think on the asmr channel um because i've uploaded a video for like a couple of days so that'll go on tonight but yeah, I, oh, I just feel glad it's over. I'm not going to do any filming tomorrow. If I do, it would just be something really chill and simple. Maybe something like craft vibes, maybe. Um, but we'll see. But at least I've got a few backups. I've got a few backups for this channel as well, which is good. I've got a few vlogs that I haven't put public. I've got um shopping haul at Iceland Hall and stuff. So yeah, that is good. It's good. So that has been, you know good few hours of, of work done uh now i'm um waiting on the football result england are playing france and i'll be honest i'm not watched this world cup I, I really like we both got into that last one what was that the euros <laughs> we really enjoyed that um but without going all like into it i and nathan have just kind of refused to watch because of where they're playing and things that happen in that country the building of the stadium you know, how they treat people who are LGBTQI+, etc. It just, it doesn't sit right with me. Um, and seeing our kind of players being like all holier than thou, and then they've just still, you know, all gone over there and commentators who make out they're so perfect have all gone over there getting paid for, you know, doing the commentary. And I'm just, I don't know, we've kind of just de decided not to watch it. Um, however, they are in, I think, it must be the quarterfinals tonight again. Is it quarterfinals? Is against france so um i'm literally interested because my mum and dad have got a bet on he thinks france are gonna win and she thinks england are gonna win so they've got a five a bet and i'm just nosy if my dad wins he said he's gonna give me a pound out of it so it's not very uh it's not very good if i say i hope france win for a pound but no i just look at the end of the day obviously clearly i'm english i want england to win but like it's just a bit it's just an awkward place that they're playing and everything that's gone on there um, but yeah, waiting on the kind of results. I don't know if it'll go into penalties or not. At the moment, they're drawing 1-1. One, one. Um, I said if if it's penalties, I will watch that a little bit. Because I freaking love watching any team, really, play um, penalties. Because they're so exciting. You know, the way the goal is ready. And then they line up. And then, oh, it's just it's something adrenaline rush. I love watching penalties. I've since I was a kid. Um, so yeah, waiting on that kind of result. Um, when we go downstairs soon, mum will come up to bed, we'll go downstairs. Um, I don't know what I want to do. Like, I... I've got Mario to play. Oh, do you want to play tonight? Yeah, you are going to do it? Oh, it. cool. Yeah, I wasn't sure if we were doing that. I didn't want to kind of be annoying like a child and go, do you want to play Mario? Yeah, we've got the new um, courses on Mario that we got on the 7th, I think. Yeah. And there's like basically you get Mario Kart, but every so often, like a few months, they like add another like couple of like I mean, it's like eight courses. Yeah. So it's like kind of getting a new game every few months, and you've only paid for the original one, so it's a bargain. And the expansion pack you paid for. Oh, okay, and the expansion pack. There we go. But it was really good. But it's the first time we played them the other night, so it's kind of like didn't know the route, didn't know where we're going, didn't know what it looked like. So I mean, I'll still not remember, but it'll be a little bit more familiar. Um, I really love the London one. If you play Mario Kart, you know what I'm talking about. If you don't, you'll be like, what? But the Mario Kart London course is brilliant. You see all like the London Eye, Big Ben, like you go on the bridge and it sometimes goes up. You can jump and it's really, really good. Love the London one. 
And then there was another one I really liked. Oh, Rain by Road was good. The new yeah, Rain by Road. Road. Yeah. That was really cool. All the planets and stuff. Yeah, love that. But yes, yeah, so, okay. Well, that's good then. Bit of couple gaming tonight. <laughs> couple gaming. <laughs> Just a bit of Mario Kart on the Switch. Um, but yeah, bit of gaming then. Um, also tonight, we're going to be filming together. Nathan is the star of the show. He's the cameraman. Um, I was a bit naughty today. And uh, I shouldn't have done it. My money is really crap at the moment, I'll be honest. But like, I just, I took my mum's parcel in this morning. And then I was just like, oh, I saw these scratch cards. Um, and I was like, I'll oh, stuff it. Let's just get them. So I got £10 of £1 scratch cards. And we're going to do a video with them. Um, so yeah, we're going to film that and hopefully win. Uh, normally I like get mixed ones, but I thought I'm going to go for the same one in a row and then we've got more chance of winning, hopefully. So we're going to film that tonight as well. Um, and just, yeah, I don't know, reading really. Carrying on with this. I really want to get this done tonight. I just want to get it finished. I have chose my next book, which I don't know if it's too heavy for me. It's a quite a big fantasy vibe book. I don't know if my mind's in that setting but it is one of my favorite authors Sylvia Marino Garcia I love her books I love her writing I really connect with her um this is Gods of Jade and Shadow I um had it on paperback and I was going to read it on paperback at some point but then when I was in the charity shop the other week I found it in hardback brand spanking new look for like a pound or 150 um and obviously I prefer hardback books because the font is bigger for me to read from eyes and stuff so Lovely cover, look at that. So yeah, it's a fantasy. <laughs> Hand there. That was creep me out then. It's like what the hell's that? Um it's set in where is it set in Mexico, nineteen twenty seven. And it's kind of like I don't know, it says not a word book set in Mexico. No. I think most of I don't them think are. the vampire one was. Yeah, that was. No, it wasn't. Was... American. No, what was the it? one with the Wolf. Dog. Dog. Wolf. Uh, it says, mixing the excitement of the roaring 20s with pre-Hispanic mythology. A vivid, wildly imaginative historical fantasy. I don't know if it's going to be too much for me, but I'm going to give it a go. Um, but yeah, God's Jade Shadow will be my next book. Um, hold on. I've seen a bit. Well, Ma, you hungry? Would you like some dinner? Would you want some dinner? Din din. Okay, we are downstairs now. I thought I would do a quick little Christmas tree tour. I have been showing this in vlogs and I've done a separate Christmassy video. So if you want to sort of see more detail, you can have a look at that. But while I'm here, I thought I would show you some of the decks that we have. Gingerbread crew, rocking it out. Cute little derpy star. My clocks of my clock obsession. My little lady. I got her last year, I think, in the charity shop. This is probably one of my oldest decorations I've had since I was a little girl. Little girl. And that one. Actually, there's a few. A few that I've had since I was a kid, really, actually. Um, a Santa there. Hello. <laughs> um, over here, I've got a Santa. Another Santa. And up, just Santa's everywhere, basically. Oh, there's these little, um, you know, like the Russian dolls. We've got the Santa ones. What else we've got up here? Little teddy bear. He's so soft and fluffy. Got some tinsel. Snowman. These are cute, these little houses. Love these. If you've already seen this in other vlogs, I'm so sorry, but there we go. I love this time of year for our decorations because we get a nice little array of cute peoples that come out at Christmas. Oh, and I have obviously I'm Jewish, so I've got my um my Hanukkah decorations. I'm not impressed with these though, to be fair. I paid like seven quid for two and on eBay, and they turned up and I thought they were gonna be like huge and dangle down and they're literally like this big. I mean look, they're not awful. They look, like, nice, like, the colouring and that, the blue and silver, but I just thought they were going to be massive, and they're just not. And then we've got the Star of David one that the, the hook broke, so we just hooked it on the back door there, and that's that. Guess what time it is? 
It's Mario time. Look at that watch. What time is it? <laughs> it's Mario time. It's time for you to lose a clock. Yeah, oh, funny. Right, who should I be? Well, no, I'll let you pick. I'm you feeling pick. a connection. I'm going to guess on, and I'm going to see if you can guess who I'm going to be. Mm -hmm. Scary. Is it King Boo? Yeah. How do you know that? <laughs> is it that obvious? <laughs> it's others that are scary. Yeah, but... Why did you just go for him? I don't know. Yeah, it's King Boo. His tongue out. Is that yeah, King Boo? It's yeah, King yeah. Boo. You know what I did say the other day? What did you say? Guess who? No, Mario. the game, guess who? But it was Guess Who Mario. Yeah. Oh, cool is that? Yeah, they do other guess who's. They do different guesses. Yeah. I'd play that. Yeah. Mind you, I don't know the names. Do you think you'd have to know the, like. Well, it probably says at the bottom no, of the No, I know they say the names, but do you have to be like, oh, he's in this game or that game? Or would you just say looks wise, like they're doing Guess Who? Just do looks wise. Is he? So yeah. if you was like. I don't know, he's got a green hat. Then you'd, you'd know it's Luigi. That's right. Yeah, or a baby Luigi. Oh, yeah. He's got a green hat as well. Um, He looks like a mushroom. So it could be Toad or Toadette. Oh, yeah. Or he or she. They've it. got pouting lips. That could be any of the princesses. No, that's that one second. Wendy. Third one in second, that one. What? Uh, second row from the bottom yeah, with Wendy. a bow in her ear. Oh. Okay, <laughs> so that was that. <laughs> anyway, I, I just thought it was pretty cool. It is. Would you play it with me if I bought it? No. No, all right. <laughs> Why not? Because it's probably quite expensive for just... No, it won't. No, it won't. We've got the actual proper Guess Who. Oh, yeah, I do love... Like actually, it. why don't we play Guess Who at Christmas? Yeah, we'll play Guess Who. The old faithfuls, the old faithfuls George and... Their faces, huh? My mum used to play that with me. She'd go, is he ugly? Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, right, okay, we're going to play Mario yeah. Kart. See you in a bit. Okie dokie, everyone. I'm going to end the vlog now because it's nearly half past ten. And we played Mario yep. as ever. You won. Yeah, we filmed our scratch card video. We've done Mario. Oh, yeah, Peter. we did scratch card video. That was good. I can't yeah, say no. if we won or lost. We'd have to watch the separate yeah. video, but, but it was funny. Yeah, we've, we've done that. You we've, won Mario. I won Mario. As ever. Um, you dinner. threw... A bomb. And, like, just one. One. Just one. It's hard. <laughs> it's just... it's hard life. I get angry. You get very angry. And you're like, why'd you get so angry? I'm you like, can't repeat what I you said. Because... No, I'm not going to swear because I'll get in trouble. Yeah. But yeah. I did swear. You swore. It rhymes with arsted and it starts with B. So if you can figure that out, good luck. I don't mean it. I love you, but it, it just gets so angry when I game. I don't yeah. game, mate, really. So when no, I do, I get this angry. Is <laughs> this is why. This is why. That's why wants to play with me. But um, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, what else? I had my dinner. I had cheese on toast. It was very nice. You had your dinner. Yes. And that's that. So. We're just gonna. I don't know if you've got any shows on to watch till tonight. Um, you got anything recorded or? I don't know. I, I don't know. No. Hopefully not mummies, in Egypt and mummies and mummies scary and stuff. Maybe I've got both. Oh god. I got both. <laughs> um, I have one of my fugglers here. <laughs> hey. Ah. Uh, I actually asked Nathan today if that he thinks they're real teeth. You're like, no, they're plastic. They look real, though. They are real, really. I just didn't want to... No, they're not real. They are. They're not. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> oh, my voice went then. From mermaids. Oh, <laughs> from mermaids. Mermaid teeth. Mermaids are real, though. Yeah, and that's their teeth. Anyhow. But, yeah, that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Hope you've enjoyed spending the day with me. And um, we'll see if there's going to be snow tomorrow. Oh, England ended up losing which you'll know by mm. now because this vlog will be on way after that, so there's no spoiler. France beat them. Yes. 2-1. So we've got a bet. I think Morocco is going to win or Croatia. Are but you we put don't a bet know. on it? I think I'm, I might have a little pound bet in the week yeah. in the betting shop. Just go in one pound. I'll have a pound bet pound. on Morocco. But then I'm not sure if Croatia might do it. It's one of them two is my tip. Someone's doing it. Yeah. Um... What was I say? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm going to read. I'm going to try and get this done. Yeah, yeah. And then on to God's Jade and Shadow. And we'll see in the morning as say if it's going to... We're meant to have snow, like, tomorrow, yeah? The nine it's supposed yeah. to start, apparently. Point, yeah. Apparently. On the weather. So we shall see. 
Um, but yeah, maybe. We'll, I don't know if there's going to be snow or not. It's not as cold tonight. No. I don't but feel as the cold. Heating has been on most of the day. Yeah, but the heating has been on for days and it's still been freezing with the heating. Yeah, we turn the thermostat up. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Somehow our thermostat had got knocked and it, it wasn't, that's probably why it wasn't why so it was hot. Probably freezing. Yeah. But, um. Now, not so much. Yeah. Not so much. But, yeah, so I'm going to just literally read and chill and I might, um, what's the time? Yeah, I've got my work laptop down here, not my actual laptop. So I might sign in and, and do, like, put a video public that I yeah. filmed before because I have some of my videos go better when they're on later anyway. So yeah, exactly. I'll see if I can be bothered. <laughs> but yeah thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video don't forget leave a big thumbs up on this one really appreciate that um leave a comment share the video out subscribe that'd be great uh check out minks laura one two three as some other links down below as are the links to my social media so we've got t uh, twitter instagram goodreads tiktok and my throne wish list if you want to care, care to spoil me and treat me um, I do have the list down below, uh, the link down below to my wish list as well. So, yeah, hope everyone's doing good. Have a lovely day or night, whatever time it is you're watching this. I'll see you very soon. Goodbye.